Hey, hey, good morning, good morning, guys. And welcome, welcome to the show. We're just getting our day started. We are here now in uh, Fargo. Well, did you hear that? I just said I just got my day started. Bullshit. <laughs> I've been driving for five hours already. Yeah. What I meant to say, I was gonna go in here and have me some breakfast. But, anyways. We are here in Fargo, North Dakota, and it's quite windy actually out here this morning. They had gotten a little bit of snow out here, I guess, but... Anyways, we're going to go inside uh, after five hours driving. I finally got a little bit hungry. The sun has finally uh, disappeared again. <laughs> uh, well, it's up somewhere, but we got daylight now, so... Uh, yeah, I got going just around four o'clock right after I got my 10 hour break and uh, here we are. So let's go in and have breakfast, guys. All righty, guys, here we go. We finished our breakfast. Did you really think I was gonna show you guys what I had this morning? <laughs> well, sometimes I do and sometimes I don't, right? That's just how it goes, but anyways, let's get back in the truck and make our way home sweet home. I'm looking forward to that. I'm telling you. Been on the road for a long time now, even did a reset on this particular trip and all that fun stuff, right? So let's jump back in the truck and hit the road. Time to hit the road, guys. We're coming up on the I-29. Just left the uh, Petro truck stop and uh, roads are looking pretty good, although it is still cloudy. It's, uh, at least it's not snowing, right? So that's the good part about the whole thing well, we should be home in about four hours give or take I'm saying right now we got uh, well 37 minutes after 9 central standard time so uh, yeah that should put us home what about 2 o'clock for sure that's kind of what I'm thinking so that's pretty good, I like that. Go home and got home pretty early then, you know. And then do all my paperwork. We got quite a few places that we went to this time, right? So uh, got a little bit more paperwork than usual to do. So that'll take me a little bit. Do all that paperwork and then uh, I think I'm gonna take my bed sheets and all that home. Get the wife to wash all of that and then i think i'm going to take me a few days off from making videos that is uh i'm thinking about uh just you know maybe just a couple of days off you know i've been making videos very steadily for who knows how long now right i mean i take a day here and there but other than that, I generally just, you know, take a day here and there and that's it. Other than that, I have a video up every single day of the week, right? And I think it's time that I take a couple of days off and what better time to do it than right here over the holidays, right? I mean, uh, all of you guys are busy with your holiday stuff anyways. Mind you, by the time you watch the holiday videos it would be New Year's right because I'm seven days behind but still I think it would be a good idea for us as a family to just have a quiet peace and quiet time for a couple of days take a few days off I'm kind of debating on whether or not I'm gonna leave uh, Thursday or Friday I'm kind of debating on it yet I'm kind of thinking leaving on Friday to go back on the road and uh, the wife is coming with me on that trip so uh, look forward to those videos guys those should be quite interesting at least I would like to think so but anyways let's hammer down and go home I'm looking forward to spending a few days uh, off spending some time with my family maybe some friends we'll spend some time with our friends watch a bunch of movies like we ordered those movies right they all came in this week 
We'll probably be watching a bunch of those. And just have us an all, uh, all around great time with the families, right? Well guys, we are now in full blast winter, I guess you could say. As you guys can see, it's... <laughs> It's definitely changed from earlier and uh, I got a very light load so we got uh, around 30 miles an hour gusting wind coming straight out of the west meaning coming straight across the street and I know the road doesn't really look that bad but because I got such a light load I have slowed right down so that we uh, I'm going to be uh, safe out here or try and do my best anyways and try and make it home and I still haven't gotten my okay that I'm good to cross the border so I'm a little worried that I may not get my okay to get across the border here before I get there. Well we'll see, we'll see. I know I'm only about 30 miles from getting to the border so uh, Hopefully they get all of that set up and straight out and straighten out before I get there. Cause I sure would hate to sit there at the border yet. So I left early this morning trying to get home early, right? And that would suck having to sit at the border and wait till they finally figure something out, right? But in the meanwhile, we're gonna take it easy. Hopefully we can make it home tonight. I have made it across the border ladies and gentlemen. Matter of fact, we're already on Highway 23. On our way home, sweet home guys. Yeah, I like this. And uh, yeah, they've gotten quite a bit more snow up here than we, uh, we saw up there in North Dakota, that's for sure. For the most part, it looks like it has quit snowing but you know I mean there's still a little bit of snow flying in the air but for the most part it's pretty much done I think got a little bit of blowing snow but nothing too serious either although I am looking at that screen it looks pretty neat though especially with them filters on there right with this uh, white snow everything gets so white that a lot of stuff can get blown out right and Actually doesn't look too bad on the screen there, so... Uh-oh, we got an ambulance, but he doesn't have his lights on, so that's good. Anyways, I don't think I told you guys yet how many days I'm thinking about taking off yet. I, what I'm thinking about doing is uh, maybe today will be the last video until... Uh, well, you know, today is uh, what? The... Uh, 23rd and I'm thinking about taking off till the 28th that's kind of what I'm thinking about doing so this way on the 28th when me and the wife get back on the road then I'm planning on starting to make videos again just to get a few days off and you know take a break from making videos and whatever right well yeah as you guys can see uh, I haven't seen a single snowplow all day long, pretty much. I don't remember seeing one at all yet. And it goes to show you that they're not out here today. Mind you, I don't blame them. I wouldn't want to be working today either, right? It's Sunday, December 23rd. Now, I know this part here, this bridge is a little bit rough. They're trying to build a new one right there. That's why this stretch is under construction, right? But other than that, yeah, I'm planning on having me a couple of days off. I think that will be good too. I will like that, that's for sure. So let's enjoy the videos while you guys can, right? While they last. <laughs> but I'll be back on the 28th. Even if I don't go out, I might even be back on Thursday on the 27th, who knows. But for sure on the 28th. That's kind of my plan. So you guys get a little bit of a break from me and I get a little bit of a break from making videos and we can regroup, have a good family time and hoping all of you guys had a good Christmas because I know by the time you watch this it's already past Christmas, right? But anyhow, let's hammer down and go to the yard, 
take care of business and go home and spend the evening with the family. Sounds like my uh, my brother wants to come over for uh, this evening. He really wants to watch some of them videos that I got the other day. Should be pretty interesting to watch those. I'm kind of interesting to interested to see if the quality has really improved. I doubt it. I think they might have done a little bit of digital touch up on it because they are considered redone, remastered, and they've been put out as Blu-ray discs now. So supposedly they are a little bit better, but we'll find out when we get home. We'll pop them in the computer and we'll take a look, right? I'm hoping I can actually play them too because they're actually coming from Europe, right? From Italy, actually. No, France. I, I keep saying Italy. They come from France. And so, because it's Europe, they got a different uh, format that they record them in, right? I think over here, I forget what it is. I know it starts with an N, but I forget what it's called. And I think in, uh, in Europe, they... They're P-A-L or something like that, or P-L-A or something like that. And up here, I forget what it is. I know it starts with an N, but that's just the format, the, the way it gets recorded. And so, over there in Europe, they have 50 frames a second, and here we have 60 frames a second kind of deal, right? So, that has something to do with all of that, right? But anyhow... Let's go home. What do you got to say there, Mrs. Jesse? Did Daddy come home? Huh? Did Daddy come home? Yeah, I know, right? You hear the water running over there. You love a good shower, right? Eh? I know, you're getting ready for a shower. And I just got home. Yes, indeed I did. And guess what we're checking out? We're checking out this bad boy right here. You guys see that? Ha ha ha. These are all the DVDs that I have just gotten. I know we still have the uh, shiny uh, paper wrap on it, so I know some of the people out in Paraguay, they're really gonna be jealous. They would love to see these movies, I guarantee you they would. They got, I believe, 20 discs or something like that. I believe that's what it said. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. There we go. Yeah, let's open these bad boys up. And these are supposed to be Blu-rays. And let's see if we can play some of them. I am really looking forward to that. That's for sure. <laughs> 